It was a perfect storm, really. From the very beginning, I think most people did see him as a joke. This is a TV star who knew how to work the medium of television. He was the first smash mouth shock jock candidate. Quiet. A lot of Americans like that stuff. He had a resonance that transcended logic. It was emotional. He just said whatever came to his mind. Crude, oh, hypocritical, dishonest. That's already baked into your understanding of who he is. Trump can survive the unsurvivable. And we'll raise you four or five Clinton accusers. <laughs> as long as we keep responding as an audience, that's how they're going to try to win elections. Has our political framework changed? You can't go back now. The public has changed. Politics has changed. How does Donald Trump win? How does he not win? <laughs> See how much fun I had? Hey Lisa, here with a bonus movie fact. Did you know that the set for the Ten Commandments was buried underground for decades? Cecil B. DeMille, director of the 1923 film, thought the movie set, including 21 Sphinx replicas, was too valuable to let other filmmakers get their hands on it. He figured it was cheaper to bury the set than to move it, and the artifacts remained underground near the California coast for 94 years before archaeologists found them in 2017. Do you like my shirt? You can get one for yourself in the link in the description.